What about your own performance? What did you feel? Obviously, you know, I'm disappointed with you know, how you know, I play individually. And, uh, you know, you got to be better. You can't you know, turn the ball over and expect to win games against good teams like Oklahoma. Tommy, two rough weeks in a row kind of for you. What needs to change to get better for Arizona State? Uh, you know, we just got to be more consistent and, you know, um, you know, deal better with, you know, certain situations, stay out of, uh, you know, some negative downs. But, uh, you know, just got to continue to, you know, work hard and get better. Obviously a tough situation with two losses this early in the season. A lot of BCS talk in the off seasons. Do you kind of feel like you're in jeopardy with that now? Yeah, we're just focused on you know getting ready for uh, Arizona State. You know, we're just taking one week at a time here. Coach mentioned that the, the second one to TJ might have been a missed out or something maybe on his part. What was what went wrong on the second interception? Yeah, there was uh, you know miscommunication within the play. But you know as a quarterback, your job you know is to erase you know negative plays when you know things aren't perfect. And, you know I got to be smarter with that and you know know when uh, you know plays and you know, run the way we're you know, supposed to. Be. Talk about how you guys were going on the ball today. Yeah, we knew we had some good run looks um, coming into the game, and you know we had our backs running hard, and you know we had some checks at the line that um, you know gave us favorable looks. So you know we thought up front we did a great job blocking the tight ends, receivers, and the running backs ran hard. What does George give you as a back when he gets more carries like this? What does he give you as a yeah, think, component to the offense? Yeah, I think he showed he has a you know big playability. He's got you know speed where if you know he gets out in the open field, he can. You know, run by a lot of people, and I think he showed that today. And uh, you know, continue to you know be a good asset on offense. A little bit of that extra look with Andrew Hendricks today for a couple of plays. Does that? What, what do you see that opening up for your offense? Yeah, I think you know it just gives the defense another thing they have to prepare for. You know, helps us in certain situations. Uh, you know, um, obviously, you know we use them a lot. You know, when we needed a couple of yards down in the red zone, so. Um, just another component of our offense, and you know, Andrew can help us win games. There's no point in not using it. Does it throw off your rhythm at all when you're stepping off? No, the not really. You know, um, you know, I, not really. No. With the start, how tough is it to get refocused after giving up the two touchdowns in the first two minutes and 45 seconds of the game, and, and yeah, the, play your way back into the game? The group of guys we have, you know, it's not you know, too tough to fight back. Obviously, you can't. You know, spot a team 14 points like that right off the bat, and uh, you know it's tough to you know fight back. But I'm proud of the way we did. And, um, you know, obviously the start you know, hurt us a lot. Tommy, you said you guys take things week by week, but just what's the mood in the locker room after a loss like this? Yeah, you let it you know sit for 24 hours, and you think about you know how you can get better and where you need to improve, and then you know come tomorrow morning when we check in and stuff, it's uh, you know it's ready to go for next week, and you, know, you can't. You know, sit there and uh, you know, still kind of lost. When you win this game, it's irrelevant where you play next week. You don't care, but is it almost good to get get away after a, lo a tough loss like that? Is a different uh, Sunday. You know, we just need to you know get ready to play next week. You know, regardless of where we're playing. You know, we love playing at home, but um, you know, we'll get ready to go for this week. And you know, we have a, another tough challenge ahead of us, but we're gonna have a great week of practice and get you know, prepared ready to go. So.